building up hype to the Drag Mall Legends sixth anniversary. But before we actually get into today's video, we actually have a sponsor. So we're gonna check that out first and then we'll get into the video. I get it. You want a chair that's comfortable enough for you to work for long periods of time, game for long periods of time, or even just to relax in general. Well, if you're in the market for a brand new chair, then FlexiSpot has the answer for you with their C7 chair. The FlexiSpot C7 is an absolutely fantastic chair that provides great comfort and functionality. With lumbar support and adjustable headrest and even adjustable armrest, the FlexiSpot C7 has exactly what you need in order to be comfortable while you're sitting down. Plus, you have the option to pick between mesh and foam for your seat. And you can even change the color of the chair and even add a footrest. And to top it all off, the FlexiSpot C7 can pretty much accommodate anyone it can support up to 300 pounds and is designed for people of all heights. So you can rest assured that regardless of who or what sits in the chair, the FlexiSpot C7 can handle it. Currently, FlexiSpot is holding their brand day sale, which only happens once a year, where you're able to get up to 60% off of their products. And if you check the website and use the exclusive code BDC7, you can get an additional $30 off of their products. So if you're interested in the FlexiSpot C7, now's the best time to get one. FlexiSpot's brand day sale lasts from May 21st to May 24th. So if you're in the market for a brand new chair and the FlexiSpot C7 captures your interest, then make sure to click my link in the description below and use the code BDC7 to get yours today. And thank you so much to FlexiSpot for sponsoring this video. All right, so we're going to hop into PvP and we're going to be using all of the summonable units from the Drag Mall Legends third anniversary. But note that this is a theme team battle video. I'm doing this just for fun. So the goal is to win at least one battle and that's it. To reiterate, this is a themed team battle video. I'm doing this just for fun. So the goal is to win at least one battle and that's it. Anyway, let's do it. So uh, this is probably going to be the most difficult team to use even more so than the first anniversary units and i say that because the only updated unit out of all six of them is gogeta because his zenkai released at the beginning of the year so yeah this is gonna be really really hard like we have nothing I i'm gonna lead off with you you lit he has to be in every single battle there's no way that he can't be However, uh, who do I want my... He's probably going to bring Pycon and Super Gogeta. That's not going to be fun. I am going to opt in for Nova. Like, at least with Nova's main ab ability, I can trap them in. So there's some hope, but... Oh. Oh. Okay. Uh, huh. Well, that doesn't mean that this will be easy, though. So, the main thing is, we have to activate his revival. Point blank. When it comes down to him, he's going to be there defensively, but I have Gogeta. So, I have element factor advantage, and Gogeta's a defense type. So, yeah. Dude swapped immediately. Alright, let's get it. Alright, here we go. Downside is, Nova Shenron doesn't have any... Wait, what? Okay, let's win this. Oh, that was a bit too fast. Oh, barely got it, though. Smack, because I literally only have strike. Alright, you big dummy. Keep it going. Die! Hmm! I need strike arts. I need it right now. Oh, well, never mind. Cool. All right, so revival activated. Uh, Vegeta's not charged up at all, so that's good. So, uh, not bad. Not bad at all. Okay. Bad choice. All right, let's get it. All right, let's get it going. Pop this. Uh, bring in Goku. Okay, cool. Uh, so, Goku's in. Uh, hopefully this deals a lot of damage. Because if I can at least get him close to endurance being activated, that'd be fantastic. Not affected. No. Okay. 
Thought so. Oh, it w oh, that's right. I'm element neutral. And mm, all the damage. Oh my goodness. Element factor came back at the worst moment. Darn it. Like, because I was about to pop the main ability and then try to get Goku out quick, but yeah, that messed everything up. Uh, that's fine. We'll do that. You have no cards. You popped your main, that's fine. And burst attack! That dealt way too much damage. This is Nova Shenron. That's fine. That's totally fine. Uh, not what I wanted to happen, but totally fine. Yeah. Okay, that's okay. So, I still have access to Rising Rush myself. Well, I don't remember if I had Rush or if I'm down a Dragon Ball, but... Yeah. Uh, yeah. Swap. He just, he just charged in. He did not care. All the key blast. Strike. No. Why? Okay, well. That's a free kill and they forfeited. Okay, we take that. Like, I'm honestly really surprised at how much damage Nova Shenron dealt. Right? Like, that unit is not good. He's not. Right? And he dealt... That damage was, like, a clean, like, 40, like, 45% of Goku's health. It hit really freaking hard. I'm genuinely impressed. So, there's that. However, well, actually, you know, because we did fight powerful units, but with him, again, his Zenkai released this year. It was at the beginning of the year. So, he has a legit fighting chance. On top of him, just in general, like, his kid is good. So, having him is going to be fantastic. Not only that, with this team, you don't have a purple unit, so you're safe. Uh, you're absolutely going in again. And I guess that's the coverage I kind of need. Why do I have a... Do I bring in Vegeta? Hmm. You know what? Actually, no. I'm going to opt in for Nova again. Because I'm sitting here like, do I really need Vegito? Like, Because in a sense, yes, because of um, you know these guys, but he's there. Like, it would just give them, like, literally a free, like, unit to just wipe out. It's it's not worth it. So, yeah. This is not a good hand. Okay, there we go. Mm. All right, let's get it. I mean, it was kind of obvious. Let me guess. Special move? No. Oh, okay, cool. We take that. That could be mine? Oh, it, just, it wasn't even close. <laughs> it was not even close. Nope. That's why Gogeta's there. Alright. That's one cover change down. That's fine. Alright, let's back off. Ooh, good patience. Uh, let's do this to try to have you throw out your ult. Um, again, Gogeta's a defense type, but this hits hard. If I lose Gogeta, it's over. Whoo! Swap. Even with him taking the damage, it's worth it. Even with him taking damage, it's totally worth it. Oh, well, I mean, you're dead now. But, worth it. Oh, I'm alive! I need to be able to swap, man. Die! Alright, keep it going. Hey, hold on. <laughs> Nova doing his thing a little bit, bro. Oh, darn it. Okay, that's fine with me. Back off. I mean, element factors here. Like, fuse moss who have corrupted. Why? Why? Okay, well, there's that. Drop. Yep. Ah, oh, darn it, my key. Or not my key, but my cards are gone. Whew, we're hanging on by a thread. I need strike, and I need it right now. 
And of course, I got it too late. Uh, he's surviving that. Wait, hold on, whoa. Alright, popping this. I need somebody to take all sorts of damage. Don't care who. His... His health is too high. Like, who am I kidding? Like, if I'm lucky, then maybe. Okay, great. All right, keep it going. Perfect. Popping this now. If there's anybody who needs to go... It, oh, wait, I forgot. <laughs> he gets health uh, from people popping ults against him. Not good. Oh, well. Kamehameha! Oh, damage. It's... I think that's fine. I think we're okay. Okay. And AOE! Oh, you just threw it out. Dude did not care. Dude did not care at all. Dude just threw it out. Okay. Not good. So, again, I can rush... I can, but I need to be able to try to wipe somebody out. That'll be the best case scenario for me. Main, that's why I didn't do anything. Back off. I expect strike. Or not strike, tackle. And Big Bang coming on! Nice and dead. All right, there we go. All right, die! There we go. Okay, so uh, we managed to make that work. This is somehow working better. Like I'm so lost because when it comes down to literally, okay, yes, in comparison to like the second anniversary units and the first anniversary uh, units, obviously these units are more modern, right? But really, when it comes down to it, the only like truly viable unit. Okay, well. 100% him because again he got updated this year and then apart from him it would technically be him because of uh him having unique equipment so i don't know this, this is great i'm honestly shocked at how how this is working but hey you know okay final battle this is definitely gonna be more difficult because the cell oh pairing that up with 17 is not gonna be fun either okay let's see i kind of want to get vegeto in this time but there's literally no reason to bring him in like I, I can't believe this. I'm, I'm bringing Nova again, cause somehow, some way, Nova's been cooking. Like I, I don't, I don't know how. I don't know how. And luckily, they brought the right unit, so that's also fantastic. But Nova has been better than I thought he'd be. I, I'm still shook at the damage he dealt against uh, Kid Goku. Like that special move damage was pretty substantial, to say the least. But, um, again, doesn't mean that this battle is going to be easy. We have the right units. Uh, these two are in the wrong order, but we still have the right units. Hopefully, we can make something work. Let's see. Oh, he backed off. It's fine with me. Why? Okay, well, there's that. He just rushed in. Dude didn't even think twice. All right, back off because you have a special move. All right, there we go. Kind of obvious. Dude is just rotating. Okay. Bam. All right, Kamehameha. My, this hand is terrible. Let's go ahead and drop whatever you have. So if you have a main, you're going to have to use it. All right, let's go. Nova should not be doing this damage, bro. Nova should not be doing this damage. All right, and that wipes out Cell because we're locked in. That worked out. I, okay, bro, I don't know what's going on anymore. Like, Nova should not be that solid at all. But he's been cooking. All 
right, here we go. Yep, of course you're bringing them. And, hmm, nice and dead. Ooh, good patience. I mean, you have no more leverage. I'm getting rid of Zamasu. Uh, there's no reason to keep him there. Like, again, he has complete element factor disadvantage against 17. There's no reason to keep him. Oh, and he lived. Even better. All right, Nova, go ahead and put in work, bro. There we go. I mean, generally was not expecting Nova to put in work like this. Oh. All right, let's see. Supreme offense and defense. No. Follow up. Like, I literally could swap to anybody else at this point. Let's throw this out. Burst attack! No. And there's that. Okay, so... Uh, I mean, I wasn't trying to use this. It's just... You know what I'm saying? Mmm! Delicious. Bad idea. Okay. And there's that. Now they're gone. I genuinely and wholeheartedly do not know. I mean, apart from Gogeta, do not know how this team worked. I don't know. I look, bro, you I, I couldn't answer it. I, I honestly couldn't. Because in truth, again, like I said earlier, when it comes down to this team, apart from Gogeta, because he got a Zenkai this year, and Fuse Monster have corrupted because in technicality, he does have a boost with his unique equipment, regardless of if it's a big boost or like a small one. Apart from these two, these units have not been updated in any capacity, like at all. So the fact that we were able to really make this team work is crazy. But to give this team credit, though, they do have units with a bit more of a modern kit than the second anniversary and especially the first anniversary units. So maybe that helped out somehow some way i mean just the fact of us using nova shenron like being able to trap the opponent in help it, it helped like we were able to wipe out cell that way so yeah i'm genuinely shocked but this team worked but i do want to know in the comment section below are you guys willing to try out the third anniversary units before the sixth anniversary again let me know in the comment section below but with that being said i'm akuba like share and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next video